A UK dog is getting worldwide attention for its ability to find dinosaur fossils. In 2016, Crystal the Beagle sniffed out a leg bone from a wool woolly rhino that dated 250,000 years ago. The pooch has been finding the remains of prehistoric animals ever since. Crystal belongs to paleontologists and owner of the fossils galore, Jamie Jordan. And both of them join me from Peterborough, UK. Welcome. Hi, Angie. How are you doing? Oh, we're wonderful and quite fascinated with what Crystal has been able to do. So sort of talk to us about the types of discoveries that she's been able to make because bones have a very specific type of smell and, and, and this is quite unique. They do, yes. Yeah. So she's she's found quite a few Ice Age bones um, from woolly rhinoceros uh, to buffaloes and even uh, a few fragments of uh, uh, woolly mammoth. Um, but she's also come across other fossils like uh, sea urchins, uh, belemnites, which are guards of squid, and mm -hmm. uh, even ammonites as well, fairly ones. So how exactly does it work? I mean, how have you been able to train her to find, you know, these fossils and, and sort of what's her process like? Okay, so uh, the Ice Age bones, they still have like organic materials still inside. Mm -hmm. um, so that it tends to give off quite a, a noxious smell. Um, to like animals like beagles and, and other dogs you know, that have a good sense of smell. Um, but other fossils that are like millions of years old, they're preserved with uh, different minerals. Um, so you've got for, like, your, your pyrites, which is like a, an iron sort of uh, mineral, uh, mm -hmm. which has a, a sulfurous sort of smell to it. Mm -hmm. um, and you've got other minerals as well, which have different smells, which maybe we might not be able to smell, but um, beagles like crystal uh, mm -hmm. wouldn't be able to smell. And what was it that sort of prompted you to say, you know what, I'm going to try and help train her to, to sort of try and discover fossils? I mean, it's quite in, in, in your line of work. Well, um, I've had the fascination of fossils uh, since the age of four. Mm -hmm. And um, I've always looked up to uh, someone called Mary Anning, um, the very first ever fossil hunter. Mm -hmm. um, and I've read up so much about her that um, she even had a dog called Trey, um, but she trained up to hunt out fossils. Um, and... I wanted to do the same thing uh, once I got my first dog, which is Crystal. Um, that's the first thing I wanted to do. So it was a, a long process of uh, uh, teaching her what to look for, uh, how how to sniff it out as such. Um, right. So teaching her what, what different scents there were um, and then treating her along the way. So after she found them, um, she she would always get a treat. Well, you know, she deserves some pretty big treats for all those incredible finds she's been able to make. Pretty fascinating. Jamie Jordan and Crystal the Beagle, thank you so much, both of you, for joining us. Thank you.